Hi, everybody. Andrea Carvin here at Inner Sparks Rehab Gym and Spa. Take two. We lost signal on that. So we're going to try again to talk about is the weight of the world on your shoulders. Here at Inner Sparks, we help high achievers learn to move in ways and rehab in ways that are everything but average. So today's topic and our topic this week has been about shoulder injury and things that we can do to uh, prevent injury. So the topic for today is the weight of the world on your shoulders. If it is, let's talk. So when the weight of the world is on my shoulders, okay, I'm living my life and moving with my shoulders like this. And when I move my shoulders like this, this is about as far up as I can get them when I have the weight of the world. What's happening is your shoulders are mapping for tension. And whether you realize it or not, your thoughts, your worries, your cares are held in places in your body. And the shoulders are, again, a prime uh, topic and target. And when we start to map, remember the weight of the world, so our necks and our shoulders are working together, um, that kind of map makes for weak shoulders, sore necks, sore shoulders, and decreased range of motion. So what do we want to do? It's way better to be able to move your shoulder like this than just like that. So try it for yourself. Turn your arm in and see how far you can lift. And then turn your arm out and see how far you can lift. And notice when you're starting to carry the weight of the world on your shoulders. Uh, these are little signs. And if you are having mapping and you can't seem to move your shoulders without having pain, tightness, cramping, there's lots you can do to reverse the maps. So let me know, give us a call, put it up on the comment section, and we'll come up with some really great solutions so your blurred maps can become way more efficient. And you can walk with and enjoy all the fun and pleasures of having shoulders that move really well. <laughs> All right, everybody. Have a great day. Take care. Take care of those shoulders. Tomorrow we're going to be talking about shoulders and sleep patterns. So join us.